today is ridiculous. Look at this weather. Oh my god, it's so nice. I just hope those clouds are coming towards us so that they'll cover up the sun, because I don't like the sun. But oh my god, the weather right now is perfect. No, that's not, that's not true. I wish it was cooler, but just compared to how hot and gross it's been for the past few months, today is very nice. Very nice indeed. Um, so it's a bit of a ride to this store that I'm going to. Maybe four kilometers. No, not that far. Maybe just three kilometers. Um, so, like, a mile and a half or so. So I'm going to take my red bike. Hopefully it won't get too hot. Um, and I'm going to go shopping at this place of my nostalgia. Yay! <laughs> uh, I almost forgot the memory card of this camera. I was out here and I was going to film this little scene of me being like, wow, it's so nice out here, and then it was like, no memory card, so I was really lucky that I checked. Otherwise, <laughs> it would have just been a video of me being like, hi oh, guys, I went to the store but I forgot the memory card, oops! So yeah, there's that, okay, bye. Michi no Eki is basically a farmer's market. Um, and when I came here with Japanese mom, it was almost totally empty, because it was like, right after school. But, it's a Sunday today, so of course it's packed. Everyone does their shopping on Sunday. Holy cow, oh my gosh, there's a lot of people here. There's like a golf course out front. Oh, I'm going to see some of students. I'm going to find a place to put my bike. Looks like it's under heavy construction right now, too. house out here. Pleasure Tower, the Tower of Pleasure. I can see this from uh, my school if I look out the window. Um, yeah, it's kind of funny, isn't it? <laughs> it's just like this giant pleasure shooting up from the ground. Uh, there's so many jokes that you can make about this. Apparently, it's a pachinko place, but still, it's funny. It got very hot. 
so I didn't actually buy anything at Michino Eki. What you saw in the video is pretty much the extent to which I <laughs> stayed there. I wasn't going to wait in those lines, so I was just like, might as well leave. I'll go some other time when it's not so crowded. I just got back, and I looked down my bike chain and happened to notice that it is, like, so rusted. Like, rusted solid, practically. And, um, I've been noticing as I'm biking, it's, like, making a strange sound, so... Uh, I can conclude now. I thought it was a problem with the gears, but I can conclude now that it's the rust. <laughs> the crazy rust. Anyway, I'm going to go to the vending machine. Please share with me my first experience of buying from the vending machine outside my apartment. As I said before, I'm not crazy about the options that are in here, but I like CC Lemon enough. Oh, <laughs> I guess I took too long. <laughs> okay, take two. CC Lemon. It's uh, 70 lemons worth of vitamin C in every bottle. Um, some people, they come up here in their cars and they stop here in this spot and they just get out and they get a drink and they stand there and they drink it and then they <laughs> leave. It's so odd. And that's totally normal and people do it everywhere. You'll be like driving. And someone will just <laughs> pull over the side of the road, put their hazards on, stop at one of the 10,000 um, bedding machines that are everywhere, and just stand there outside their car, pulled over to the side of the road with their hazards on. Okay, fine. <laughs> I like that I go out into public looking like this. <laughs>